How's it going? Welcome back to Dylan Pickups. Today I want to show you something, uh, the latest build we just got finished with the other day. You might have seen the time lapse of the construction of this guitar. The Nikita Guitars Tin Man. This is the uh, first in a series actually. This particular one has Dylan Pickups P90s in it. Uh, what a piece of art, huh? This is absolutely beautiful. Um, it is a chestnut, reclaimed chestnut body actually. It's got an ebony stripe in the back, which is actually comes out of the same piece of wood as this ebony fingerboard. And then we also ha have the neck bound in aluminum. Really cool with the marker dots the way they are. Three plus three head. And I know you telly guys may not like that, but that is, that's pretty cool. It's this beautiful, beautiful piece. Spurzel lock and tuners, uh, gold and black to match to everything else. Uh, this is a pretty neat body. This is a chestnut body that is chambered in a couple of places just for balance. So tonally, you're going to see that this is something very cool. Um, the body is physically a little bit bigger than a regular telly because the aluminum is the same size as the telly. And then the outside is a little bit bigger. It feels a little bigger in your hands. Uh, it has a belly cut in it, very just a very moderate one. I cannot explain to you without you holding this in your hand how natural this thing feels, um, just, to, just to even hold it. Uh, with a set neck the way it is, just, just, the, just the overall balance of how it's put together, um, it, it, it's very, very cool. The aluminum, uh, tonally, wait till you see how, how cool this thing really is. It's not what you would expect at all. Jersey Shore Guitar Garage provided the uh, switching for it. So it's got our normal, uh, as we call it, shoop switching for our tellies, five-way switching. So you've got your normal three positions. And then the first notch position here is serial, and we'll show you that. Basically gives you kind of like a humongous humbucker tone, which with the P90s, it's pretty big. And then it's going to give you uh, like a, a half out of phase tone. Uh, with this guitar, it sounds fantastic. So um, just the detail on this thing is, is really, really, really something. Um, it's got a brass string block that is also very, very cool. Um, and a brass nut. Tiger maple neck. It just, it just keeps going. You could look at this guitar for a half an hour um, and not get tired of it. Just looking at it before you even play it. But let's play it. Um, talk to you about everything we've got going here. So we're going from the guitar into a Keeley Electronics Luna Overdrive just for a little bit of crunch. I just want to show you what it, this thing is like a little bit dirty. And then this is kind of the other star of the show back here. Fuchs actually sent us this uh, for, to do some testing with these guitars. It's a fantastic amp. The uh, Fuchs Mantis Jr. We're just going to use it on the clean channel. It has a fantastic clean channel, a lot of power. Um, with the Fuchs 4x12 cab, and then we're going to go into a PreSonus USB and Studio One. So that kind of just gives you an idea. Let's play this thing. This thing is just clean, is where it really. That's just on the neck, posi neck position. that I don't know if you can hear that or not but it's not bright like you would think just a big fat huge tone now we can even get bigger with it when we switch it to a serial mode and it gives us kind of this how do you want to say a uh, split humbucker tone? Now, if we put a little bit of crunch on that, that gives you an idea. So it's just a really, really huge, huge tone. 
obviously we've got our middle position like a normal Telecaster, uh, but with these pickups, it gives you a nice big tone. <laughs> The thing I can tell you about this guitar after playing it for a well, few days is it sounds still like a Telecaster, uh, like what you would expect, even though it's not a Tele. It still gives you a tone that you expect, even with the P90s, just huge, just a huge, huge. It feels like the guitar is 10 feet wide, uh, and to be in the room with it, it's incredible. The actual acoustic properties of it with the hardware setup the way it is, uh, you can hear the guitar from across the room like and it's, it's an acoustic and it just has that huge tone that just kind of bounces right out of your arms. Check out this serial half out of phase or this uh, par parallel half out of phase tone uh, in this other notch position. <laughs> almost kind of a stratty kind of feel and uh, it just makes it super versatile here's the neck position or the up oh, sorry the bridge position <laughs> just playing some similar riffs with the same pickup so you could kind of get an idea uh, a very telly still but like I said, just very, very huge. One of the things that uh, is very cool about this tone circuit also is the way this is set up, uh, it, it has like 10 feet of range on the tone knob. I'll show you real quick. I'm just gonna pluck one note and then I'm going to um, action the tone knob from bottom to top. Just the tonal range in that in that is fantastic. So if we go back, for instance, to our neck pickup and roll this thing off a little bit, it's kind of got that big fat jazz box feel out of a solid body guitar. This thing is really cool. P90s from Dylan Pickups, wiring from Jersey Shore Guitar Garage, and a beautiful custom piece by James Malazzo from Nikita Guitars. Please check it out. We're gonna have two more of these guitars coming soon. One in a Les Paul style body and then one in a double cut body that you've never seen before. This thing can do anything. It can play rock, it can play blues, it can play country. And we're going to show you some demos of some various uh, different styles coming out of all of our guitars. Please check back with us next week on YouTube and like us on Facebook and do all that stuff. But please keep checking us back because we have some more cool guitars coming. This one right here being the Nikita Guitars Tin Man with a Dylan Pickups P90s and Jersey Shore Guitar Garage uh, wiring. And again... We want to thank Fuchs for sending us the awesome Mantis Junior amp uh, to do all of our testing with. We will see you next time.